Assalamu alaikum dear students of class 3 how are you i hope you will be fine welcome to your english class open your book oxford progressive english ope page number 18 dear students we are going to study unit 4 animals news unit 4 lesson 1 listen and speak dear student here is mr bat's family he is mr bat she is sandra and she is emma and she is mrs bat and he is dan they are sitting on a dining table and eating food and they are discussing that where should we go during the spring break they are planning for a visit in a spring break so dear student let's let's read their conversation and listen to me very carefully mr bat what shall we do during the spring break after winter and before summer when the weather is very lovely we call it spring in western countries there is a, there is a vacation period for schools and colleges in a spring season they call them a spring break Now Sandra is saying let's go to the zoo. Emma, yes, one of the tigers has just had cubs. So tigers ke chote chote bachon ko cubs kehte hain. Matlab Emma keh rahi hai tigers ke abhi abhi chote chote bacche hue hain. Bahut zyada maza aayega. Now Mrs. Bat is saying that that's good idea. We could also take some bananas for the elephants. Now look at these italic writing at the end of this conversation we have to add our own sentences instead of these italic writing Then let's take some nuts for the monkeys Sandra and we could take some bread for fish Mrs Bat what about us shall we take some snacks snacks So yahan pe snacks ka matlab hai khane peene ki cheeze jaise chips pakode samosa wagera usko snacks kehte hain इसीलिए मिसिज बैट कह रही हैं कि हमें अपने लिए भी कुछ खाने के लिए देना चाहिए एंड मिस्टर बैट गुड आइडिया वी कैन स्पेंड द होल डे देर मिसिज बैट वाट शेल वी डू इन आफ्टरनून मिस्टर बैट लेट्स गो बोटिंग ऑन द रिवर वी कुड गो सेलिंग डैन मतलब ये लोग जू जाने के बाद बोट बोट में जाएंगे नदी पे बोटिंग करेंगे और सेलिंग करेंगे Mrs Bat you can go sailing if you want I'll go canoeing with Emma Mrs Bat saying Mrs Bat ke liye ki agar aap badi boat pe jana chahte hain to bhali bhale jaye main Emma ke sath canoeing karu canoeing ka matlab hai choti ek boat hoti hai usme do ya teen log baith sakte hain fir wo aista aista safar karte hain aur bahut maza aata hai Sandra I'll bring my camera I want to take some photos especially if you guys fall in dear students now look at the sentences i have underlined bread for the fish snacks the whole day there these are the sentences in italics now you have to read the text again and add your own sentences instead of these italics i'm expel i'm explaining to you for an for example The rest of text will remain same you have to just change the words in italics that's uh, mr mrs bad that's good idea we could we could also take some breads for ducks here is bananas for the elephants i uh, i have to change the name of the animal uh, uh, we could add by ourselves and i have said that some breads for the ducks and dan is saying that let's take some nuts for the monkeys we could say here let's take some grains for hens grains means anaj anaj ke dane hum murghiyon ke liye hum anaj le ja sakte hain aap dekhen ki kaun se animal ka favorite food kaun sa hota hai aap apne tarike se animals ke names likhte hain aur apne unka favorite food likhna hai aur three sentences aapko animals ke bare mein banane hain aur yahan pe aa rahe hain 
थ्री सेंटेंसेज अलग हैं तो ये देर आर ओनली देर आर ऑल दी सिक्स सेंटेंसेज वी हैव टू वी हैव टू मेक यहाँ पे स्नैक्स की जगह आप कोई अपना खाने पीने की चीज़ लिख सकते हैं यहाँ पे इन्होंने मिस्टर मिस्टर बेट कह रहा है कि वी कैन स्पेंड दी होल डे पूरा दिन वहाँ पे स्पेंड किया है आप अपने तरीके से लिख सकते हैं कि आपने कितना टाइम वहाँ जू में रहना है ये लोग जू में जा रहे हैं तो पूरा दिन वहाँ गुजारेंगे तो आप नाउ यू हैव टू डिसाइड व्हाट द टाइम द होल डे एंड हाफ डे और थ्री आवर्स और फोर आवर्स नाउ आफ्टर द जू दे आर गोइंग टू फॉर बोटिंग ऑन द रिवर ओके नाउ यू हैव टू डिसाइड वेयर यू हैव टू गो आफ्टर द जू For example, you have to go for a lunch, or go for a visit museum, or go for uh, uh, for look on circus. You have to go for circus. Now, what you have to do? You have to read the text again and understand the text, understand the whole conversation of bad family. and read the conversation and add your own sentences instead of these sentences italics which are in italics and record your audio of reading and send it to me so dear students record your audio in your clear voice and send it to me you have to read the conversation and uh, adding your own sentences instead of these sentences i hope you understand the lesson You have got it very clearly. I'll be back with another interesting lesson. Till then, Allah is take care.